Turn the lights off in his bedroom. For tonight I will be dreaming of you. It's the one thing I can rely on when everything else is so confused. I'm not leaving. No, no, that you're here with me. Don't wake me up. Don't wake me up. Don't wake me up. I may be dreaming, but what I felt for you is real. Don't wake me up. 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 to our From Scratch series. Um, I just showed you some basic clips of us killing green dragons, some loot from dark wizards and pretty much us getting anti-dragon shields and such, getting ready for dragon killing. Um, and here you can see me alking the green dragon chaps we made as the best thing we could ma make at the time. So we accumulated a couple of thousand gold for uh, a slayer staff each and uh, then I went for some cake stealing and then right after that we went and bought ourselves uh, one slayer staff each. Um, and pretty much uh, here you can see us taking the longest or uh, yeah probably the longest route ever taken to get our prayer books. As you can see I have mine on because I have a placeholder in my bag so I didn't want to mess it up so I went there, talked to the guy uh, without getting a prayer book, having myself having mine in my inventory all the time so as you can see nothing no cheating here <laughs> it was a pretty boring route but it worked out it worked out so this is like the eastern part of relica uh, going across the bridge you fix during a different trail no wait uh it's a horror from the deep quest i think you fixed the bridge i'm um, not sure though um pretty much we went up there, got our books, and got ready for jelly killing. Um, and uh, I don't really know what to say, it's a pretty long clip, clip but yeah, as you can see here, we're going through the swamp and teleported ourselves with the drain and staff to the jelly cave, uh, the Relic of Slayer dungeon. And here you can see he got a blue scroll and he got, went and got all the stuff, and unfortunately, uh, when he got the third clue, uh, he had to use some like rune stuff or glory or whatever it was. Yeah, glory you can see there. So I always get that. I also, I also got a clue scroll now, so let's see if I can do it. Okay, first one. Equip diamond ring, amulet of power. <laughs> we can't even get an amulet of power. As you can see, I can make my clue scroll, so I pretty much dropped it. Or I didn't drop it, I did it off series. 
uh, I think it's like it was in Bad Lex or something. Here you can see myself buying a set of proselyte, uh, which I later used to go to Barrows. Try to get something good, but I unfortunately did like 30 runs without anything, so I'm not even gonna bother, sh bother <laughs> showing any more than one clip or so. Um, so yeah, uh, here I'm alking a little bit more green dehyde. Um, we got about like 100k from all that shit. And he also got another clue scroll, and this one was successful with a mystic hat. Um, I'll show you the rest of the clue in the next episode. Uh, I'm also getting myself a Gothic's cloak for Barrows. Uh, I'm doing the first couple of runs with uh, Air Blast or Bolt, I don't know. Uh, just because that's the only thing we could afford at the time, I later got some runes and started doing Slayer Dart, uh, which was more successful. We accumulated about 400 blood runes, and yeah, you'll see the out outcome later on in the series. So here I'm killing Darok and. Uh, yeah, it's going pretty well. I'm wasting a lot of prey potions on this trip, but uh, with Air Blast, it's not the most efficient run you can make. Um, yeah, it worked out, but it, well, it was pretty bad. It took a long time, I think 15 minutes per run. So I probably did like 3 4 hours of barrels without any loot, uh, which kind of sucked. But we got a lot of rooms and coins from this, so we came out on top. It's not too bad. And this is the first loot. I got some coins, a couple of mind runes, and some death runes. Um, so yeah, and click on the screen about... Oh, uh, let's see... Now, pretty much. Okay. Now, for part 3.